everyone today i will tell the divisibility rules from 2 to 6 so let's start from 2 now in this we we'll take a number suppose 5 3 6 8 now the last digit is 8 so and it's even so it will be divisible by 2 and any number which has 2 4 6 8 or 0 will be at its unit place will be divisible by 2 now we'll do of 3 divisibility by 3 so we'll take a number for suppose 6 5 3 1 in this you need to add all these numbers 6 plus 5 plus 3 plus 1 is equals to 15 now in this 15 this 15 is divisible by 3 so this whole number will be divisible by 3 and now divisibility by 4 we we'll, we'll take a number for suppose 7 6 5 6 4 in this we need to see the last two digits 64 is in first first table so it will be divisible by 4 and for example if uh, a number ends with 50 50 so it will not be divisible by 4 as the number 50 is not in first table Now we will do the divisibility of five. It's very simple and easy. In this, you will take a number for uh, four, zero, three, or and five. In this, the last number is five. Now five is divisible by five, the last digit. If, uh, if zero and five are there in the units place, then it is divisible by five. For example, now the last digit will come four, so it will not be divisible by five. Now we'll go to the divisibility of six. We'll take a number of uh, five, three, one, six. In this, you need we need to see that it should be uh, divisible by two and by three. So first we'll check by of twos. So the last place is even. So it is divisible by two. It is uh, the condition of twos is fulfilled. Now we now the threes. Uh, we'll check the divisibility of three. So we'll add it. So it will come fifteen. Now it is. successful in trees table also so it is divisible by 6 thank you